just eaten the best meal of my life. Historic places in the city uh, are here to stay. I have walked to the corner of Bleecker and Bowery for a reason. For a place that is actually no longer here, but had a great deal of meaning to this city and to music in this city and to music worldwide in the end. Gods by actually going into where CBGB used to be. Of course, now it's a hip John Barbado store, but they did pay homage quite well by leaving a lot of the original walls there. Um, the the artwork is very you know dirty, grungy rock themed. Um, but a lot of the there's an area where they have a bunch of the posters on the wall. There's still stickers. The paint is cracking. Um, it was really um, amazing experience to actually be in there uh, for myself, even though. Uh, you know, it's no longer the club that it once was. In fact, it's not a club any longer. But, um, bucket list place for me. I just wish I could have seen a show there. Um, if you guys have the chance, I recommend watching the movie uh, about CBGB starring Alan Rickman. It's really good. It'll give you good insight to the history. Right here, they even have a mural 
uh, that's actually an old uh, poster of Blondies, which is one of the many bands that got their start here. Uh, other bands include Iggy Pop, Ramones, Talking Heads, uh, Dead Boys, uh, just all, all the big, you know, new wave punk rock East Coast bands, uh, specifically New York, got their start here. It's amazing to finally make it into that little building. I just wish I could have seen the bathroom as well. Little Italy because there is a very, very old bakery there. I heard it's the best, so I'm gonna grab a couple of treats while I'm out. Chinatown in Little Italy. It was successful. I uh, went to that neat little bakery called Ferrara. Got some goodies that I am going to try to smuggle home with me as well. Going to eat that cannoli. You best believe it. Uh, but right now, um, I'm actually going to take a break. I'll get to that cannoli later. Um, I got to get on the train right now. <clears throat> so I am pretty sad to announce. This is gonna be my last night here, my last night sleeping in this tiny but pretty sweet room. Um, packing up all my stuff right now. I'm gonna go out one more time tonight. Uh, probably won't be out too late. Um, I should probably get some tacos though, because it's Cinco de Mayo. So, I might get some Mexican food, um, take another walk, just take in a few last sights um, of the city, because it's gonna be a while till I'm back here again. Probably a couple years at least. But right now, as you recall, I went to Little Italy and went to that 125-year-old bakery, 130 years maybe now. And... I got a number of things, but one of the things I got was this gorgeous, amazing cannoli. It's not here. 